Hi, this is Patricia Agner from the Rutland City Public Schools. I'm going to show you how to create an assignment in Google Classroom. I've logged into my Google Classroom and I've clicked on the Classwork tab. This is where I can create assignments and questions, use topics to organize my work, and then drag things around. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna create a topic and I'm gonna add it. Now I'm gonna create an assignment. So I've created a Makerspace contract and I'm gonna add it from my drive. I'm gonna to go to my Google Drive to do that. Here I am in my Google Drive and I'm going to select the contract and add it. I wanna make sure that every student gets a copy. So I can have students can view the file, students can edit the file and they would all be editing the same file and make a copy for each student. I'm gonna select that. I want it to go to all my students. There are no points assigned to this. I'm gonna give it a due date and I'm going to add it to a topic, Makerspace. I don't need a rubric for this. There's one other thing you wanna know about. Over here under Assign, I can assign it now. I can schedule it or save it as a draft. I'm gonna schedule it and I want my students to have it tomorrow at eight o'clock in the morning when I first see them. So now it's scheduled. So when I look at this, I see Makerspace contract is scheduled for tomorrow. Let's add something else to it. I'm gonna add a Makerspace quiz. I'm gonna add it for my drive, and I'm gonna go get that quiz and I clicked on it and I've added it. It's a doc, so students are gonna write in it. Again, I'm gonna make a copy for each student, and this is gonna have points. I can give a quiz any number of points that I like. For example, I could give this four points. There is no due date here, and I'm gonna add it to my topic, maker space. I could put a due date in if I wanted to, and then I'm gonna assign it. I'm going to save it as a draft this time because I'm not sure when I want students to do this. So it's saving it as a draft. So I have one assignment that's ready for tomorrow, and another one that's saved as a draft. I saved it as a draft so I can use it anytime I want.